Hello again, everyone. Welcome back to Potionomics. All right, so we've got uh, some potions brewing away. Let's go ahead and travel. So we can't... Uh, yeah, we don't have any uh, uh, adventurers back. All right. Um, is there anyone that I want to... I guess I could just give some gifts. Your coffers are full. I gave you a gift already. I gave you a gift. Onward to mischief! Tell me about it. Alright. It isn't bad. Indeed. Indeed. I gave you a gift. I know that. Um... I guess I could do a little shopping. I wish one hangout every day was free. That would be nice. See, I'm out of these. What am I out of? I don't want to spend too much money. I should get some more of. I don't want to get below uh, 2,000 right now. So that's part of it. I've got 15 of those. Jeez. Uh, Thunder Quartz is pretty good, actually. Um, Alright, we're going to get below 2,000. care about a copper doll. I can't use it for anything right now. I'm kind of guessing that some of the, you know, like, something around here, maybe the enhancers, because the enhancers seem to require, like, the, the enhancers and the cures require multiple things, so it wouldn't surprise me if one of these requires four and one of these requires five or something. Whereas these are all just two. But that could change when we get up there. I don't know what those are going to be at all. All right. Uh, it wasn't too bad. I didn't didn't end up spending too much money. Oh yeah, I'll be back for more. All right, that's for sure. Okay. So let's uh, head back. Get our uh, potions all uh, bottled up. Sold a little bit there. All right. Okay. Bottle those. Three stars. Perfect brew. Excellent. Okay. Ranking up. I'll accept that. And go ahead and uh, bottle those. All right, we'll have to figure out what we want uh, in a moment. But first, we can turn this one in. All right, so we got uh, common thunder tonic. There we go. Um, it's common alertness enhancer. And a common mana potion. 
81. We'll definitely take one of those. All right. Uh, so we are looking at like 800 some for. Yeah, I mean this this would sell for a bit extra, but um, I think that's pretty good right now. Are those slugs? I think they're slugs with uh, cardboard boxes on their backs. I I love that. That's great. That's adorable. <laughs> oh, so cute. All right. There we go. Sent for delivery. 830. Very nice. So that'll be 360. Greater health, greater mana. But specifically feel good. Okay, so let's see if we have a feel good. Can I even get greater with this thing? I don't know. Actually. Customization. Two fifty five. All right, so that's two twenty five at two forty. There we go. I should keep the mud pack cauldron uh, mouse. Hello, mouse. Thank you. Might be time to swap the batteries out. I don't know. 140. 25. All right, so uh, we might want to see about upgrading the glass cauldron next. Um, storm cauldron, I doubt we can do. But the mud pack is up fully upgraded, so that's a good one to have down there. And I don't think I can get these upgraded. All right. Let's see. All right, time to do some brewing. All right, so we need a greater uh, uh, health potion. That feels good. Uh, so, A and B. So that has B. That has B. Let's not do that in A. So those are twelves. I mean, I don't actually need all of that. Um, what if those cancel out? So, let's see, A, we just need a 12. What's 12, A? That's good. So that'll definitely be greater health potions. Um, I don't need that much. Uh, so A and B without anything else. Okay, just B. 
barely a, a greater health potion. Um, in fact... Because this will automatically tear up. So I don't really need anything better than that. And in fact... Alright, so I want to... Putting in another ingredient is not going to get me any more. Um, so it, you get one with two, two with four, three with six, four with eight. So the fact that this can hold seven doesn't get me any more. So that's not really doing anything. Uh, this will definitely rank up to greater. So I think that this is going to be exactly what we want. And... Let's go ahead and do two brews, because I think I will go out and hang out with someone. There you go. Okay, recipe. Alright. So we need B and C. I need a 12. Alright, I don't have any good B and C things other than this one. I need lots of uh, high value seeds. So now an eight. Don't taste bad, but that's okay. That doesn't matter. No, 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 no. I need uh, 12. So common, that'll rank up for sure into greater. Okay. So that will definitely go for that. Because we got that. Yeah, alright. Uh, so I want that done in two... So there we go. Alright. <clears throat> Next up. So C and D. So we got 8. We got only 240. And that's going to be a, uh, a bit of a stumbler. So B and D. That's way too much. But let's see what we can get. Okay, so if I can balance this out... So I need 14 more.
Eight that doesn't suck. All right. Um. So there's no two, so I can't do that. Um. There's no ten. No, I think that this is the best we can do. That's going to brew nine. Uh, we're going to get four of those. Um, so we need a uh, greater speed potion with three stars, and that's what we're getting before this. So it's definitely going to bump up to a five star, possibly tier up to the next tier. So I think that is going to work for us. Uh, we were taking a, a little bit of a hit because of that uh, taste penalty, but and the sight penalties, but you know, I can't really do anything about that, <laughs> and I can't. So if I can get something that uh, ignores uh, the sight on a day that I sell these, that would be pretty good. But that's nine for brewing. I think that what we want to do is. Get it down to six. We're looking good. It'll uh, brew overnight, but that's okay. But then we'll have that one knocked out, and then we can focus on the greater ice tonic. Okay. Let's go ahead and uh, brew that. All right, let's go see if we can get rid of some of the... Uh, some of our... Penalties. Um, yeah, whatever sells there is fine. do some travel. I have no idea how much hanging out uh, helps. Um, or we could rank up, uh, I think, Luna. Ah, but we need to lose the stress. Let's hang out with Roxanne. Well, look who it is. A card game boosts relationships slightly and relieves a bit of stress. I can spare time for a game or two. Roxanne produces a deck of cards, which she shuffles in an effortless and intimidating display of dexterity. She grins at Sylvia as she deals. There's something wolf-like in that grin. Although Roxanne promises to go easy on her, Sylvia is clearly out of her league. Here, why don't I give you some pointers? It's not much of it's not much about the luck of the draw. It's more about how many aces you can hide in your bustier. <laughs> Sylvia feels a little closer to Roxanne and mildly less stressed. How much did that actually uh, alter my stress? 5%. Okay. Alright. That's not bad. And Zid is back. Don't die out there. Thanks. I outdid myself this time, if I can toot my own horn. All right, so we've got uh, two Achillens Trihorn, two uh, Swamp Octopus, and two a Sack of Hive Slime. I'll accept that. All right, Adventure. Five points and eight points.
alertness increases the chance your hero will retrieve ingredients with good traits. Extra loot from any monster or hazard by 25%. Okay, that gets us all the way through. But I am using a really big ice tonic. I do this. We'll take no damage from these guys at all. That's still kind of necessary. Um... I'm blowing a lot of money, potential money here. Not much with the uh, health potions. What if I just give you more health potions? Like that's the other thing is like you could you could just uh, give lots of health potions and not have to worry about the damage to a certain extent. Looking at really a lot of money here. But we would get through this entire thing, and I'd get extra loot by 25%. Is that worth it? Um. If I had basic health potions, that would actually be a pretty good. Yeah, I mean, ice, ice tonics aren't that great. On the other hand, I can sell them for a lot of money right now. So yeah, let's uh, let's skip that. Uh, I don't actually have any good common fire tonics. Fear, I'm on it. All right, then we can uh, rank up with uh, Luna. Should I get anything? I'm gonna make some more ice tonics. It's 120. This is all cures, which is pretty nice. I could work on making a lot of uh, ice tonics tomorrow. Uh, 
Uh, B and D, A and D. These are a pain in the butt to make. And this isn't, it's not cumulative with anything right now, so let's hold off. If I ever get a, get one that's like potions, just like potions campaign, yeah, I'll, I'll go for that. Um, or even just Tonic's campaign. Definitely go for that. Well, let's go ahead and rank you up there. What's up? And I just realized that I goofed up. Oh, well. Tell me more about yourself. I'm curious. Oh, sure. I have a copy of my CV that you can take with you. It lists everything. Degrees, internships... It basically starts at kindergarten and keeps going. <laughs> That's good information to have. I didn't mean your credentials. That's good information to have. Eh, I didn't mean your credentials. I didn't mean your credentials. I'm curious about you as a person. Wow, that's a tough one. I mean, where do I even start? You stumped me, Sylvia. Well, are you new to town? Oh, yes, I've only been here for a few months. I've been working for a big marketing firm in the mainland, and I was really good at it. But I wanted to branch out and do my own thing, spread my wings a little, you know? And there's no better place than, for that than Rafta. I don't have to tell you that, though, do I? We're both here to find success on our own terms. I confess I know quite a bit about you. I do my homework on potential clients, you see. Ooh, my very own stalker. Uh, learn anything interesting? Learn anything interesting? Oh, did you figure out where I left my sandwich store punch card? Um, no, but feel free to keep me posted on that. I'm rooting for you. I only did some light digging. It's good business sense to know uh, who I'm going to be working with. But more than that, think of marketing at its best as a tool for elevating worthy people and ideas. You might not be the most lucrative or stable client I could pursue. Hard to argue with that. But you have so much potential for success, Sylvia. You've got skill and ambition, and from what I can tell, you like what you do. If I can help you give a boost towards success, then I feel like I'm using my own talents for good, and maybe even having a positive impact on your life. That's refreshingly big-hearted. Oh, don't be fooled. I can be a total mercenary when I need to be. But I'll work hard for you, Sylvia, if you'll let me. I'll even give you more pointers in case you they're helpful. For instance... As young business owners, we have stressful lives. But keep in mind, stress doesn't have to be a bad thing. You don't have to let the anxiety of the job sweep you by, sweep you away. You can lean into it and ride it like a wave instead. Lean into it. Raise interest by three for every five points of current stress level. Discard one card at random. Oof. A positive spin on stress? I like that. Helping people see things in a new light is all part of the job. And I'm good at what I do. I mean, just look at that CV, Sylvia. It's a thing of beauty. <laughs> yeah, plan accordingly, thanks. Yeah, I goofed up. Well, Mint is back, so I guess I'll go uh, get her re rewards. I made some progress, but the monsters got the better of me. Okay, we got uh, Spider's Bait Diamond, uh, Fairy Flower Bloom, and uh, Vargas Canine. All right, I'll accept that. Drowsiness cure. Well, that's not going to get you through there. This 
is very much brute forcing. Okay, so... Can't really do anything there. Uh, can't take it out, but we'll get some good loot. She'll get some XP. She w did go up a level. I don't know if that's making any big difference in stats. It doesn't seem to be. Which I was really hoping it would. Good choice. I'm on it. Right, back to my shop. Nope. Shouldn't have gone back to my shop. Poop. Oh, well. Uh, made some more money from the vending machine. Alright, so we can uh, do that. Um... That's not good enough. And just do that for now. I think that's increasing those prices too, and I should have been doing that earlier, but oh well. Uh, Alright, well, I only have one bit of time left. Let's go check our brews. Go ahead and bottle those. Bottle those. Turn this one in. One twenty eight and All right, so uh, we're making a little bit of money on that. Not as much, but it's an okay markup. All right, so it is about time to wrap it up, uh, the episode. Uh, had a very busy day. I'm going to want to get some things going overnight, and then I'm going to head out to Quinn and just... Uh, sell some, uh, like, get some more ingredients in there. I think more, uh, health and mana potions. Just because, um, uh, I mean, they're good to have on hand and, um, you know, just all around decent stuff for selling as well later. Unfortunately, we are not going to have tonics available, but, uh, it's okay. So I just need, uh, three, like, get it down to three, and then we'll be good. Anyway, I want to thank you guys for uh, coming out and watching, and I will be back next time. See you then, everyone.